keep going. See what this is gonna be. Let me just capture that again, as it seems to be a bit. Tribes caught a fluffy hulk. Better watch out, it's no pet. Good old fluffy hogs. They couldn't keep it down. Fluff hogs on the loose. Every time you get close to anything, it's just not worth it. Yeah, definitely not worth it. Wait, what's the point, man? Oh, gosh. Come on. Maybe I should have just been the shooting guy. It was harder than expected to take down the Fluff Hulk. <laughs> They've received news a Ronin joined the tribe's ranks and were looking forward to meeting you. A group of Jagni warriors are already waiting for you at Myriad's Vespi. You should hurry there and help them storm the outpost. <laughs> That you chose to ally with Jagni is a sign of strength in itself, and you'll only make them stronger. I don't always think it's that one. Burst of boots after a double jump. Yeah, well. An emergency box from the old days. Wow, bet that nut makes a tight fist.
Right, Justin, anyone know how this runs on console? So this is on console, so you're watching it on PS5 right now. Switch weapons either use quick selection menu gear and the headsets. Tunnels like this still carry echoes from the past. Where's my Can normal weapons? This game's really weird when it comes to normal like my normal I don't want to use one handed stuff. Where's my... This is weird. <sighs> the blank attacks. That's not my normal weapon. Can't work out how to use my normal weapon. Get dodged. How are you, Justin, anyway, man? That notice board, filled with the leftovers of used to be once. You're getting close to one of those old Toxanol brick towns. Pay attention. The Toxanol Corporation made this place, and then just threw it away when they were done with it. Toxanol never cared about the waste, as long as they didn't have to pay to clean it up. 
There must be a track somewhere in this brick town. Just hope it's not buried. So many critters make their home in the forest. This corner of the world is called Bricktown. Let's have a quick piss. Let's see. You need to hydrate, man. That's some yellow water right there. You need to get the pegs lined oh, up no. to get the clothes soaker rolling. Shit. You need to turn the pegs in sync. Just a few moves left. Make them count. That's close. I need to mess that up. You really move. put a spin on it. Three. Heroes are only heroes for others, but they do the work, or they're heroes to no one. Loot gets worse if you fail those. These FYI, my loot gets worse. Do you mean the puzzles? Hey Ross, by the way, <laughs> thanks for coming back. Um, but can I like, so say I've got nine, ten turns? Can you cheat? Can I do nine of the ten turns and then press circle and leave and be like, nah, I'm done. Basically, don't fail one, is what you're saying. Oh, you might have to answer this. How do I get my, um... How do I get my normal weapon back? Because if I go this way, I don't have access to my dual... Handed weapon. These are all single-handed weapons. I don't have an issue. The hand thing's pretty cool, but, like... I can't work out how to get my normal weapon back. Main menu. Gear. I guess. Inventory. No. Oh, go back to gear again. Craft. Out. 
fits. A little geezer. Right, let's click on my hand. Yeah, these are my single-handed weapons. How do I pick my... How do I use my normal tridents, Raphael turtle things? Is that not equipped? I don't understand. Everything you can equip should be the. Uh, I don't understand. I started off with two like Raphael tridents. I don't know how else to describe them. You must know Raphael from the turtles, the things he uses. There are things out there waiting for you. Stuff so weird. You found the track. Amazing it wasn't destroyed. So much of this place was just discarded. No, it was never nice. It was new <laughs> once, but that's not nearly the same thing. Ah, just being like new never lasts. The tracks moved on from Bricktown, and you should too. Sponsored by Diet Coke. Disclaimer, not actually sponsored by Diet Coke. Right, level up. Have dual guns, so I don't think I can have dual guns anyway. Circle, square, R2. Have you played lots, Ross, or have you been working and stuff? It's Peekaboo Park. Young ones love this sort of place. Corks everywhere. No, it's fine. Feel that sunshine. Hey, buddy. How you doing? It's very Star Warsy. Left here for dead. Oh, 
has heard that you have a sense of compassion and trusts its See, I keep doing good things, even though I want to be the dark side, I feel. <laughs> Asks you to do the right thing for the sake of your conscience. It's only through your inner conflict you're held accountable for your actions. I already feel good. surprised you chose not to help. Feeling good is not the same thing as doing good. <laughs> yes, that's the way. No arguing with that. Sometimes your gut is flat out wrong. Don't ever doubt yourself. You are number one. Even the dark knows you're better than this. <laughs> Stick with me. We'll rule the world. I feel weird doing the nasty things because I never do that in any game. I feel like I want to start again, be nice. It's a myriad tribe outpost. Pound them down. Okay, let me <laughs> Don't give up now. Goodbye. It's Kung Fu Panda. That's what the game is. Literally. The right and wrong of Kung Fu Panda. With Star Wars esque. Help, the tree could live a lot longer. So, says you covered the important things already. Oh man, <laughs> I give up. Every time I do stuff, I just end up going light. I'm going to be balanced, it seems. You might not be myriad stock, but you shine so good. Understands completely.
You found a biocontaminated container. Collect biolabs and use these to unlock mutations in the menus or change your appearance of the biopods. Does it hurt to touch it or is it just... No, it just gives me biopods. Light for the win. I don't think I have a choice. Outpost, long time home of the Myriad tribe. I never, like anyone that's ever seen me play any game or play games with me knows, I never pick the darks like choice. I'm always the nice guy. So when it gave me the choice at the beginning, I thought it said strength and something on the dark side versus like agility and magic on the light side. So I was like, I, I'm doing a strength build. I'm going to go dark for a change. But like everything I seem to do, it just makes me bloody do nice stuff so i don't know i give up let's piss on a post oh that's better let's too much see. diet coke oh. hey dude Penalinde. hey Penalinde. Uh, hit them where it hurts inflict as much suffering as possible and make it clear your try oh shut up and let me in so clearly you haven't come here to waste time Here's the first line of defense. That's a puzzle. Back in the spot, wrecked it. Dark on the left. Yeah, when you get a straight choice, I get that, but that was literally just something on the floor that I picked up, and it said interact, and then I interact with it, and it gave me a choice. Right, go up. Easy wins, easy wins. I bet there's going to be some shit ones of those later on. Yes, the river tubs going down the drain. Keep going. Yay! is holding a helper. Thanks. I mean, it's not obvious. The guy's chained up and he's wearing black, but other than that, yeah. Beefcake. 
says they've been treated fair, but is glad to see you. Hopes you'll treat the rivals with the wishes there was another way, but they'll do their best. A sharpshooter. The scaffolding looks unstable. <laughs> Better stay clear of the Red Ray. Here's the second line of defense. Can you run into that pulse for me? Better big bump will bring it down. Switched off the light. A barrel shoot. Smack it to get a barrel out of it. Then hit it toward the gate and blast it. That looks slowly. Shoot it and watch it blow. Not kaboom. You're in. Almost there. That's the only game I know where you can't uh, um, smash up stuff on the floor. Like. The outpost belongs to your tribe now.
He says you made them weaker, but they won't give up. Your Sifu thanks you. Your tribe is growing stronger. That's it. Give it a clean. Oh, God. I'm so important, I must be carried. He reminds me of the meerkat from... Uh... Tribe weapon. Each tribe has a tribal weapon. You can defeat rival tribes. You acquire its weapon. By helping your own tribe, you acquire its weapon. You are now aligned with a tribe. You can decide to switch your alliance. Tribe. Go to tribe 4. Talk to see if they change your allegiance. Says you did a great job capturing the outpost. You've earned the privilege of carrying the tribe's weapon. Says you're lucky to have the honor. Out of date says he's doing his best to keep up, but from what he can tell, it seems you're making progress with He had a feeling you get along with the Jagni tribe, but it remains to be seen what the future holds. Your positive outlook on life might be just what the Jagni tribe needs to complement theirs. Which is somewhat But out of date emphasizes that solving the tribe conflict won't matter unless you help make a stand against the world eaters. That's the sound of impending doom. Out of date's premonitions of imminent disaster are true. The porky puff needs to be handled. Get old porky puff. Eh. He says the time has come to confront Goop is working on making his goo glide strong enough to break the waves out to the world eater. Yeah, you mawa, Oluwoya, Lu, Yalu Bato, Luyu. This is all about you. Whether you succeed or fail, it's on you.
Giving me big Zelda vibes. Apparently that's how I think anyway. So weird, man. We do the same thing. Oh, no, one is. Feels good on you. I can't put them on yet. <laughs> Is it your kind of game, Reese, or? Not really. Says it's hard to worry all the time about the. Maybe a ringdinger would take the edge off. Says it rings all the dings. Just like you'd expect. <laughs> Reese likes a ring dinger. Before someone else hauls it off. You can ring anyone you like then, right? Says to just I'm sell honestly it to not a sure, good dude. Owner. Those voices are right doing my head in. Yep, 100%. 100%. Oh, you pay. Shopkeeper claims you won't be able to find better goods anywhere. Says they're known for their high quality. I have no green stuff. I don't even know how to find the green stuff. So. Let's go. Come on. It's not pulling me in at all, story wise, that's for sure. Days wasting. Get to work while you can. Oh my gosh, I think I might stop beeping. I feel like the green stuff maybe it can't hear me to do that. Can't stop thinking of Kung Fu Panda now thanks to Reese. That 
There's Subnautica Station. Goop flounders around in there. Camera is not very good either. I mean, it's not done by a big. Um, what's the word? Developer. It's quite a small developer, apparently, and. Um, it's also a PlayStation 4 the game, so. Calls. Like, I was thinking the graphics are not that impressive. But I forget, it's a PlayStation 4 game, it's not a PlayStation 5 game. Ooh, a biohazard like that can make you real sick. Oh, I'd love that. It sounds like, um, what was it called? Um, do, 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 do. No, I've forgotten the name of it. I'm so Let's cool. see. The funniest thing is like pee on posts for. Uh, fast travel points marking my territory. That's the funniest thing I've found so far. It's very uh, button bashy as well. It's not very uh, skill based. I mean it will be in the sense of by the moment I feel like just pick a shoot character. I should have picked the, did nothing but shoot character. That's what I feel like at the moment anyway. I picked the tweener, the guy who does both, but... Hey, Goo. Hello, Goop. Gulpo ain't the easiest tongue, but I think he says he's happy to see a friendly face. Not too many of those around these days. Says it's good to see you again. He's Goop. You might remember him from the old days when he tried to teach you how to swim. Goop says memories fade surprisingly fast. We are He knows he's easy to remember. There's <laughs> Goop says our memory keeps things for us and protects right, them Reese, you still are to face them again. He understands you've returned to face Lupa Lupin. That's the destiny you've been carrying within yourself all these years. He says that the catastrophe back then didn't vanquish the good in you. It's still there, as bright as when you were a child. <laughs> Now the time has come for you to remember and act. Your life is your life. No he understands why you seek um, Is Ark cross-platform or is it how just make PlayStation? You once you claim I know it's on See, other platforms. I mean, on my side. Go, dark, go. Instincts can be truly awful. The fun thing is always the right thing. <laughs> Next time, look at it with a clear heart. Darkly dark, dark. <laughs> dark, did you dark, dark? They're the best too. Says life on the goo is wide open. You have so many choices of where to go. Some harder yeah, okay. of course. Which kind do you like? Hit the open surf then. The trouble is you can only rely on yourself, at least until you reach a new shore and make new friends. Yeah, it's all good. It's free on a Xbox Game Pass, so I was just asking. Wishes you hadn't done so much to make the goo even gooier. Wonders why you're flapping around with the Jagni. They spend too much time nesting to do anything fun. Thinks you're only proving his point. But hey, back to the goo. Knows yesterday is already gone. 
It's what you do today and tomorrow that'll move you forward. Oh, no, shut up. Yeah, it's annoying, isn't it? He can't leave the Subnautica station as the pollution has worn down the insulation of his suit. So you must salvage enough scrap to fix up his goo glide, starting with the old wreck box outside. Out of date told him the undersurf was the epicenter of the contamination. This was where it struck hardest and inflicted the biggest change to the ecosystem. Like if you, yeah, I just read that one. of the water in the ground is I'm spreading. still happy on COD so don't worry it's all good I'm not bored of it like you are I'm really enjoying the uh, asphalt at the moment and playing we're playing randoms got two wins yesterday boom two wins with randoms Just a few moves left to make them count. My house is not full. Just wait for Arc 2 next year, buddy. You're honestly doing yourself a favor by not playing it. No, it, it's nothing to do with that. It's your fault. You're just a horrible person who played games with me, made me happy. Then I went back to work. I can only play a little bit, and then you're not around. No, because you're on Arc. So then I'm like, oh, I'm going to have to play Arc if I want to hang out. I know how it is. As long as you're happy about it. <sighs> Completely. I wasn't suggesting that we need to go and play, um... Cod. I'm only kidding. I'm not fussed. I've been playing um, Destiny anyway, so obviously, yeah. I just like bitching about you on, uh, on the stream. forget you can't guilt you there's no guilt in him it's darkest between the stars
<clears throat> you found a circuit board puzzle. Switch the lights using this. Change the color of the light by pressing X. Switching the color of one light will also change all adjacent lights. Use the moves to make all the lights turn green. Okay, that's just annoying. I don't understand. I'm not clever enough at this kind of stuff. If I press that one, it will make that red and that green. Boom. My brain was like, no, I'll do it. <laughs> I don't like those ones. Yep, I don't like those ones. The other ones are easier. Sponge Blobby! <laughs> Sponge Bob. Hey, buddy. Hey, Vinny. Swing like you mean it. Is that the new Rambo skin? Yes, yes it is. This is this is definitely uh this is what happens in downtown now. Yuck. Fire has it. Sick. How are you Vinny man? Some mad updates I know man. Maybe just bringing it in. Have you seen that new auto rifle? It's sick. There's a change in the air. Feels like daybreak. Well, 
What do you know? I don't know. What do I know? Toxanol's offshore drilling caused oily matter to spread with the rain. Yeah, fair. Contaminate both fair the groundwater and open surface. It's never simple, is it, man? The long-lasting effect this had on the evolution of wildlife was, as we know now, I'm trying to enjoy my day off. reason we came to exist. I, mean, I still had a two-hour Zoom call on my day off, but uh, yeah. Looks like the switches need to be turned to match so enough charge can flow through the conductors. Just a few moves left. Make them count. Nailed it. Good. Got a couple of wins yesterday with some randoms. That was nice. The actuators and activate the framework. In um, rebirth, though, not proper. Just absolutely clapping people with that asphalt. I haven't tried the new sniper, like, because I've used the Car 98 forever. <laughs> but um, I feel like with this new um, Cold War suppressor and all the stuff that people are saying that maybe, uh, maybe the Car 98 isn't the best anymore. I don't know. Maybe I should try some other stuff. Uh, I'm just training for the new job, but I got so much I need to get done before I start properly as I'm not He's got guns the have time to do function. it after you will have a I'm not gonna have time yet. Net, but no armor. Real life sucks. <laughs> Why would the government pay me 80% to stay at home for the rest of my life? Why? I entered a competition on the radio the other day. I've never done that in my life for no other reason than the prize was enough for me to uh, quit my job <laughs> and I was like I'm entering it I mean I obviously didn't win anything but and I just wasted money but it's not the point there are lots of valuables left behind on the surf floor that the salvage net will enable you to haul you just need to find the right spots stop rubbing your belly you little weirdo devised a cannon for the goo glide but instead of bullets, it flips quacks. Squeaky distractions for the triple attendive porky puff, which will give you Thanks time for to get yourself in Raided position. with nine people. Ah, oh, Tuesday, bless the best you. Way to find quacks Aussie is shark. To is that shark? Shark? He has the it's not shark, is it? Of the How are we doing? Raid! <laughs> this means you Tuesday raid. Thanks, Chris, man. Thank you, everybody, for coming in. Be able to give you directions to where you'll Welcome to the weird world of... Biomutant. Sponsored by MRSK.club. If you need any monthly masks sent to you, they are an awesome website, by the way. Uh, it is me, it's Shark from Tuesday Games. Nice. How are we doing, Shark? How's everyone doing? Sunburst, how are we doing? Julian, how are we doing? Wika Ward? Sorry. <laughs> my bad, my bad. Para Asylum, thank you for the follow. I assume you're all part of the raid. Thank you so much for popping in. Bloody tired here. What time is it there? Good you. I'm, I'm alright. I'm alright. This is my day off. Uh, for those that don't know, I run a pub uh, in the UK. So, uh, yeah. Whitney, thank you for the follow. Sunburst, thank you for the follow. I feel like my... Uh, Thing needs moving. I can't see your beautiful names. Coming back. Almost eleven thirty. Yeah, nice. Oh, I feel like I've got that wrong straight away. Go rest, dude. Gaming isn't worth losing sleep. <laughs> it's all good. It's half past two. Lunchtime here where I am. I think I was supposed to ask about something. But... This is a new thing. I've not picked this up before. But yes, I'm very good, thank you. How was Tuesday's stream? Is he um, still playing Fallout? Bless him. What was the decision, actually? Does anyone know? Did he decide to uh, get affiliated and stay just on Twitch? Or... 
Um, <laughs> para, it's... <laughs> He's drunk as fuck. <laughs> Oh, he lives the dream, that man. He lives the dream. Full-time streamer and gets paid to drink. Nice. Anyways, I'm uh, following out, so I'm going to go to bed. Tuesday stream is good, but he's gone. Laugh out. <laughs> Cheers, Shark. Get some sleep. Bless you. Thank you for coming in, and thank you, everyone, for raiding. Uh, Para, I just feel it's a little bit childish. Uh, reminds me of Kung Fu Panda, if you've ever seen Kung Fu Panda. Um, You're poking around Pokwur, a prime village. This oh, okay, here is the Sinky Dink, home of Gulp, at the Gulp. very least. <sighs> so, yeah. It's one of those things, isn't it? Did he decide? Has he, has he gone full-time on Twitch, or was he still streaming on both today? I've heard that that narrator doesn't shut the fuck up. He's no. Pretty sure he's heard of you I don't understand why the they chose. Like, like if you're picking a game, he wonders if you have something for him to drink. Why do I have them speaking in some foreign alien language? The writing's there. I get that. And then he's just gonna tell me what they said, so I have to listen to it twice. One in a language I don't understand, and everyone in the game is his voice. But I'm guessing it was to save money. Today he was on both. He's leaning towards Twitch, but only has to make the leap. But he hasn't made the leap yet. So it's just. I mean, I got told that Bio Mutant was made by a like group of five guys, and it's not a. Um, like, Says you it's not a massive company per se. To do something <laughs> so, um, Good, bad, not really sure, maybe it was a money saving like exercise because it's just one person doing destiny, all the talk for the entire the game. But yeah, his voice is annoying as hell. I end up just skipping it, which isn't the point. <laughs> Especially this kind of stuff where it's like. Sure, I like what Venomous no have done with it's the idea easy. of the game, but they failed to, to hit the mark. Yeah, that's, that's a fair. That's fair. I was very lucky one of the community the world, paid for the hurry. game. I don't think I'd have paid £55 for it. Um, I would have waited Respect and the reviews would have told me that it was a bit too childish for my normal game style. But, uh, was that just a PlayStation LFG notification? PlayStation's got an LFG system on the Xbox now. No, it's... Basically, my clan for Destiny, we have LFG groups. So if you do an activity in the clan, we use our clan chat. If you LFG somebody, though, instead of adding them to the clan chat so that you can do the activity, they just uh, we have LFG groups to add people to so that you can do stuff. Says you'd be as bummed out as him if you came for the Destiny itself has its own LFG system, but no, not, not Sony. And his favorite... I'm not listening to a word this guy is saying. Without a drink, and radium syrup especially, he can't move, much less think, as the power of his mind is directly Have you done Vols Glass yet? Yep, so I've done it five times, I want to say now, five completions. Three characters last week, two this week. Um, I've got the seven weapons already, I just need armor now. The world so, is still I got the Vex last night on my sixth one. So, yeah, not bad. Uh, I was going to buy this game until I seen Moist Critics, Moist Meter for it, and a client have fought me. Yeah, that, it's fair. I'm, I'm definitely not impressed, is, if that's the right word. Okay, I got all excited, love for that, when I played Destiny exclusively years ago on Xbox. LFG was OP for meeting new people. Oh, nice. Yeah, Julian, it's cool, man. Um, I'd like to walk away from Destiny. I just can't. <laughs> just <laughs> every time I buy the yearly pass or whatever it is, I've got I've met so many people um, that I've met through it Destiny. It's dumber, it's just one of those things that I just I just wish they'd make some decent and he new actual new content. But I'm I'm letting the you know COVID. Example. Be the answer, and that maybe next year there are other ways than a it will be right. And I'm just sitting back this year. The good news is because I'm streaming and trying new things, I'm not on the Destiny grind hardcore, so it's not bothering me this year. Whereas the clan, people in my clan are really you can look at and touch. This guy is still going on, this guy's going on forever. 
I've tried Destiny a while back, but I failed terribly, horribly. So, apparently, so the, the truth is, the um, I think the truth about Destiny is it's it's more the community than anything else. Um, and if you really throw yourself into it or find a clan that is willing to let you get involved, um, I think it it can be really good fun clan wise. But it's poetic. Um, the game itself when you've done like the first if you've never played destiny before you've played very little people play it and they're like oh this is awesome what they don't kind of love is that's it there isn't anything else do you know what i mean mr 20kg thank you so much for the follow i think i think that people enjoy destiny a lot and then they realize that when they've got through the storylines i mean if you picked up destiny 2 now and you hadn't played it there's so much content so much for you to do right you'd get well into it however ready to live at your own speed if you do it bit by bit you know. uh sorry i'm late to the party here from tuesday games yeah well good man thank you for coming in i appreciate it still think the original was a little bit better than d2 in my opinion i went flawless once ever and it's still like my best achievement gaming to date i loved i loved it i absolutely That's loved it destiny one pulled me in enough the destiny two didn't disappoint me too badly when it first came out the and then since then it's just there's just been nothing like since day one like i'm a raid guy i love the raids um i love exploring new raids um i gutted i, I run a pub so it's really difficult for me to do the raids first because it's always on a saturday night normally and i'm i can never get saturday nights off even if i book holiday it's difficult so um but i love the raids we do go we do do <laughs> do do we do trials um I do stream trials every now and then. It just depends. Like not a lot of people are that See interested that in waste. watching. You could use that for sure. Uh, I stopped playing it when I started playing World of Warcraft again. Life out loud. I loved Gambit. Yeah, so Gambit was the most exciting thing to come out like in Destiny because I'm, I wasn't a big PvP guy, but I was getting into PvP, and then um, on top of the PvP, I loved PVE. So the idea of having both of them together, I thought was quite a cool new thing that I'd never really thought. So. Um, it did get monotonously boring, and then they tried to bring in Gambit Prime, which was nice. It was like a cooler, faster version, um, which I didn't mind as much. Now there's a in-between, so it's like a new thing. It's like a love child of the two Gambits together, but uh, I, I really like it. Give it some gas. Uh, thanks for the follow there, man. I appreciate it. Uh, I love trials, but my husband and guildmates hated it. It's it's, it's fine toxic, <laughs> but it's you know top end end game stuff, and I. There's a bit of me that hates it, and there's a bit of me that loves it, so... Let me just break this a sec. So, uh, I'm going to follow you. I'd rather... I'd love to watch Charles. Never really played in D2 because I didn't have a solid guild anymore. Yeah, fair. Fair. We don't always do it. It just depends because I'm working now. Um, and right now, everybody's pretty much doing Vault of Glass kind of exclusively, but... Um, I will obviously do it every now and then. And when we're people have bored of Vault of Glass, when people have collected everything, Trials is pretty much the only thing that's left to do. So it's generally a Monday night thing, sometimes Sunday for me, because Friday, Saturday is pure work. I never get to play it. So this is the new Biomutant. Yes, it is, sir. Welcome. The Quack Kung Fu Panda. It's, it's, a bit, it's a bit childish, the game. I'm very underwhelmed by the uh why can't you game together what's stopping you it's all about the community man i love when people I love that, like, Best two of my closest there. friends in life I've never actually met. <laughs> like, I've never met them in real life. <sighs> I wish the game I played wasn't so toxic. What do you play? What is the toxic game? And why do we always get dragged into toxic games? You're not the first or the last. I have done way too many toxic games. Destiny, I would probably argue, is one of them. Smite. So, um, literally, my, my first, maybe my first month, um, somebody asked me to play Smite, one of my community guys, um, and it was obviously free to download, so I gave it a go. I actually bought the uh, All God pack, um, and I had a go at it. I just found it really difficult to 
get into as in like really play it for a long time so uh, my computer won't run world of warcraft i don't think any more and definitely not destiny yeah bless um well so scrub law gaming who's like my one of my mates who we we started this journey together um he um he plays world of warcraft on on his pretty pretty exclusively that and he plays stuff with me like we play stuff together but you know that's his game uh, i played destiny 2 on ps4 they're doing a beta right now for class platform yeah they are yeah it's just this weekend um yeah julian drop me a drop me a message let me know what your destiny name is and i'll and i'll add you or your psn um and i'll add you because i'm all we're on that you know we're on that reasonably often so uh, you're more than welcome to jump in or uh, if we can help you do anything in the clan the clan is really nice like helping people and i mean right now for example they're all trying to take people through vault of glass for the first time because there's a emblem if you take 10 people through the raid for the very first time and complete it so like the top 10 uh raid players in the, the clan are literally just spamming invites jumping on lfg trying to drag anybody who's never done it before so if you want help just let me know smite is just as toxic if more than league yeah. is that league of, Legend? league of legends but uh oh no a new puzzle I, ugh, time for me not to not be a 41 year old useless man uh, you found a cable connect puzzle you need to connect three cables different ports to solve the puzzle each port has a positive and a negative value. These values can be seen above and below the port. To successfully complete the puzzle, connect the cables so that they add up to the amount shown on the bottom. Switch the ports using L. You connect the cable by pressing X. Oh, uh, no. So I need to add two Xs. Why not just... Oh, no, I need to add... And then not just do that. Oh, there you go. <laughs> that was easier than I thought it was going to be. I thought that was going to be bad. Hey, I'm 41 too. Nice. Good age. Good age. 79. I was just Christmas Eve, 79, my birthday. If you want to buy me a present. <laughs> uh, yep, yeah, I get around to getting a new one. I'll definitely add you. Our last PS4 died because it was plunged. Plugged in during a power surge three years ago. Oh, gutted. Yeah, man. If you get onto Destiny, anyone gets onto Destiny or COD, um, and they you know need help or want to do something, let me know. Ah, you're a little bit older. To be fair, most people that are 41 are going to be older than me. It's because I was born Christmas Eve. That's not opening on its own. Um, well, how do I open it? <laughs> Nothing under here, is there? No, I did that already. Damn it. I was quite lucky with my PlayStation 4. I had a day one PlayStation 4, and it lasted all the way through until this. I've, I only had one period of uh, overheating issues. But um, I fixed that myself, luckily. Didn't have to pay anything. Uh, I need to smash this in, which is that and that. Uh, damn it! Oh, did you get screwed over with the BDA Xbox? Yeah, of course I did. So my brother, and I got an older brother, five years older than me. We don't get on that well, but um, he, um, his birthday's in June, like end of June. And uh, it always used to annoy me because he'd wait like six months and get new presents and six months to get new presents. I have to wait a whole year to get new presents and then I get classics. So say he got like, I'm just making stuff up. Say he got 20 quid in June and then 20 quid at Christmas. He got 40 quid and then I get 30. And he'd be like, this is for both Christmas and birthday. And then my family used to make me wait till Christmas day. So I'd have presents and they'll be like, oh, that's for both Christmas and birthday. And I'll be like, cool. And they'll be like, well, no, you can't open it till tomorrow. I'm like, why? Why? <laughs> not that I'm bitter. Not that you're pressing buttons or anything. I definitely did not have the best of both worlds. I went through a couple of years of lying and telling people, um, like, being like, oh, like, no, my birthday's in the middle of the year.
Ah, I forgot to block. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do, buddy? Have it! Have a wooden stick beat you up. How'd you feel about them apples? Ooh, okay. What are you gonna do? Have it. It's all good, man. It doesn't really suck. It's all right. I was... I'm sure... Uh, why have I got to get rubber duckies? I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Oh, yeah. Find all the quacks. <laughs> I had a good life growing up. I can't really moan. Like, not as spoiled as my son is. But, uh, oh, is that a new gun? Ooh. Fire rate is very high. It's a little bit, well, it's a lot less damage, but it's an auto rifle, I guess. Let's equip it, why not? I always like to try new weapons. Is there anything else in here, then, miss? This looks decent so far. It's just very childish. Like, it's very button bashy. Um. But it's by a small developer in the bigger scheme of things. Um, I think it's a PS4 game. So obviously I've come from Returnal. If you haven't played or watched Returnal, it's amazing. It's like the best game I've played in a very long time. Um, proper PS5 game. Amazing graphics, gameplay. The controls are so... Fl the fluidity. I made up that word. I don't know if it's real. The fluidity of uh, Returnal was immense. And the difficulty. It was hard. It was a hard game. Very, very, very proud to complete it. And was very happy when I completed it. Um, whereas this... Uh, to go from that to this is weird. Because it's this is such a graphical step backwards... And, like, the gameplay and all the rest of it is a little bit, like, Dark Souls hard or worse. It. So, I hated Dark Souls and I hated Bloodborne. Um, we played them. I just, I, I really did find them difficult. It's, a lot of people comparing it, like, oh, it's Dark Souls in space, because if you die, you go back to the beginning. Yes, but there were, there were, like, many, every time you do something, you... Every time you do a run, you pick up some stuff that carries over that you can use to help you on the next run so you can build to a big run. Um, the only thing that they got wrong, in my opinion, is the you can't save your current run and go away. But you can put your system, the play at PS5, you put the PS5 in rest mode and come back another day, you'll be fine. But I couldn't leave, leave halfway through a run, play for two hours and be like, okay, I'm going to go play Warzone with my friends and then come back and play tomorrow. Because the moment I load Warzone, I lose everything I had on Returnal. So you basically are stuck just playing Returnal for a whole run, no matter how long that takes, which is a bit... Um, I don't think it's as hard as those games, because of when you start to get used to the mechanics, the fluidity of it, you realise how fast and how effective you actually are. And I, I just got better at it, if I'm honest, to a point where I felt comfortable... I felt like I could do good runs. I've just really enjoyed it. I really did. The switches so they match. Oh, God. So, right, white has to go up. So that, I have no choice. That's, I have to move. I need to go left. Right, so I need orange, orange, white. So I need... Just a few moves left. Make yeah, I don't know how to do this. Orange, orange, white. There you go. Boom. I did do that. Nice. Cheers, Sunburst. I appreciate it. Thank you for... Uh... Good. Oh, That's no. Wrong way around. <laughs> Sorry, Sunburst. Well, I got Ward. Got to run. Got to grab some smoke social media posts. Thanks for the stream and the chat, man. Hope you watch again. Yeah, I appreciate it a lot, man. Sunburst, thank you for saying goodbye to what you And I apologize for saying goodbye to you when you hadn't gone. <laughs> This is a melee now weapon. That's Ooh. what I call a blade. There we go. I love the way it's such weird. Like that's a shower head with a metal attached to it. I love that. <laughs> Mr. Twenty K, thank you so much for hosting. I've never had a host. I've never been hosted before. What's hosting? What does that mean? And thank you. Um... 
hand of death. Julian is hosting as well. I don't know what hosting means. Somebody let me know what hosting. It's also being played on my page. Oh, nice. Oh, someone will have to teach me how to do that. So that when I'm not on and other people are streaming. Um, so who streams? Who, who in here streams? Who do I need to add? So, obviously Julian does. I'm just making a note. Julian... The boy and Mr. 20kg streams. Anyone else? Does anyone else stream that's in here? Uh, I like to add people. Um, gives me someone to watch while I'm at work. <laughs> gives me people to watch. So. Oh, you don't stream. You just choose their games. We want to give streaming, give you a spark. Yep, me too. I mean, I know Chris from American Football, so we have a, a, a bit of a pass. It's nothing to do with streaming, but obviously we've connected through American Football, and then on top of that, we connected through um, being working in pubs and bars. Keep your head on and then swim. finally, the trifecta. Uh, we're both in lockdown and I noticed that he was streaming so I started watching him um, I've been talking about streaming for about three years and um, in the end my wife of all people were like can you stop moaning about it and get on with it <laughs> so if you touch the top of the screen you will see the share icon push that at the bottom of the screen you will see host your page uh. what's going on here why am I I'm stuck on a magnet or something. Oh. I don't feel like I should be taking on an armoured friggin' thing. Let's just go. Let's just go. I'm not gonna take one. I have no, like, obvious health bar, I right? no idea if I'm supposed to be taking that thing out. Careful you know of the goo. It's a rare sight. Treasure it. Wildlife here it's is home. teetering on the brink of extinction. Uh, my husband wants me to stream the since I'm playing games Nothing anyways, but I have a lot of social anxiety and don't think I could do it. Done for I am 100% behind you on that one. Um, so, obviously, I'm old. I'm ginger. My surname's Dyke. Um, I'm overweight. Um, I hide behind jokes and talking. Um, I struggle with um, depression, anxiety, all that kind of stuff in the background. Um, and I really, that was my thing holding me back for so long. But I had about 100 friends that all got together and said they'd support me from day one. Um, it hasn't really led to getting the 250 returning viewers but the initial was good and I found it really good to get it off my chest and so far touch wood um, I haven't had any abuse about my looks my weight or things I worry about in real life so um, I don't think I could ever use a cam I'm very self-conscious yeah I'm the same <laughs> um, but I felt like I was never going to be successful as a streamer if you guys didn't see me, you didn't get to know me, you didn't know who I was, you know, how how could I ask anyone to donate stars and direct donate and that kind of stuff and try and, you know, help me stop working till four in the morning running a pub. Uh, and uh, I know it's one in a million chance of going full time as a streamer, but if you don't try, you'll never know. So thanks, man. Uh, oh, I appreciate that, man. I do. I appreciate it. I Hello? Hey, calm down. I got you, goat. Miss me.
Oh, come on, there's a tree in the way. Get him, goat. <laughs> there you go, goat. Yeah, leave him alone. It's all right, buddy. Here you go. Have some food. Here you go. I won't hurt you. He's okay. Here you go. Who's your good boy? <laughs> There's always a chance. Yeah, there is. You never know. Never give up hope. I only just started. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm, it's more in my mind. It's more of the concept of 25 more years of running a pub. You know what I mean? Like it's just um, the pub I runs like a million top end sales business in Western Supermare that does a lot of money for Stonegate, but it's hard work. It's tough. It's draining. It's finishing at stupid clock in the morning and all that. Do you know what I mean? Um, so if this journey helps me smile on a daily basis and gives me something to look forward to, then that's that's worth its weight in gold. If it then leads to something, then so be it. Who knows? This almost feels like I'm watching a comic book come to life. Yeah, yeah, that's a good way of looking at it. To be fair. Oh, I get to my yeah, buddy. How you doing? Let's go. Dum -dum 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 -dum. Oh no 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 not the goop! Everything is at stake. No, come on, bud. I killed him. I didn't realise it was green. <laughs> oh my god! I just saved the goat and ran him straight into the gloop. Oh, I didn't realise there was that anyway. <laughs> the only issue is I've got what do people want to watch. I play ninety percent horror games. Not many people are watching horror. You say that, but there is. So <laughs> I didn't mean to kill him. It's the 20k. I did not mean to kill him. <laughs> um, you say that, but there's, there's, dead lot. there's a big, big market for scare games. So Wednesday night's my story night game. So Tuesday I do Hack and Slash, um, which is Diablo Path of Exile pretty exclusively um, with Diablo 2 remake coming out, Diablo 4 coming out, and Path of Exile two coming out all in the next sort of two years uh that's my tuesday nights wednesday night is a story game so that is a one player pure story not action based so that's that has been scary games silly games um little nightmares uh limbo we've done quite a lot to be fair it's in the script the, the, the description sorry i can't get my words out um at the moment we're playing the dark pictures which makes me jump and scares me all the time so that's on wednesdays thursdays is community night so that's always silly games worms four guys uh rocket league we do among us we also do a a movie voting night where we all get together and do like a just talking voting night which is awesome on a thursday night um tonight is four guys so everyone's playing four guys tonight um and then Sundays, I generally play whatever the new game is. Uh, Thursdays is my day off, though. So Thursday, daytime, it just depends. Sometimes I have loads of stuff around the house and stuff, being married, kids, etc. Sometimes I don't. So in a minute, I need to go pick up my son from school. but And I'll jump it off. But um, yeah, that's pretty much my schedule. But there's a huge demand for horror games. People like watching other people. Scared. I, honestly, people love watching me be scared. Absolutely love watching me shit myself. <laughs> I can't go in the gleep go, can I? Oh, I can do that though. Nah, you're just gonna die in the gleep, mate. That's what you're gonna do. <laughs> That's a good one to remember. Apart from I can't actually uh Oh I did. I got away with it. I jumped in, grabbed it and got out. <laughs> Uh, I don't get scared very easily. I do cause a lot at the monsters. I don't get scared as in, ooh, it's scary, but I jump. So the games that have done really well. Little Nightmares did really well for me. That's probably some of my highest numbers. How do I... What is that shadow? And what is that noise? I 
don't think I can swim across there. Resident Evil Village, I cast that lady so much, I got slapped quite a few times by my lady friend. <laughs> I finish this guy. This it? might be the end of everything as we know it. Why? What are you on about? I think he's the wrong Gump guy. says he'll bibble <laughs> anything once, as long as it's drink delicious. He drink delicious. Maybe this is Tuesday. <laughs> he found Tuesday games. He's not in a state to go looking, so he's counting on you to help. Go find him at Carbine. You're running. Right, I am going to. Oh, let's see. I'm going to chill there as I am on that fast travel point. Uh, I need to go grab my son from school. He finishes in uh, nine minutes, so I need to go grab him. Luckily, it's just literally a few houses down uh, the school, so it doesn't take me very long to grab him. Thank you so much for the raid. I really appreciate all the follows, um, and uh, hopefully some of you pop back in another time and, and check me out. As I said, later on, it will be full, guys. Um, I will probably jump back onto this, depending on what the plans are. Just before that, um, I did promise my son I would play Fall Guys with him. Um, so he'll be on the PlayStation upstairs and I'm going to try and get both of us on at the same time. Don't know if I can do that. Uh, I might have to buy him PSN. But um, we're gonna. I did promise him for his birthday that we would play Fall Guys together as he wants to play with Daddy. So um, thank you, as I said. Thank you so much for popping in. And uh, I hope to see all of you in the next one. Thanks.